Coding without AI is not an option anymore. I think most of you agree. You know, there's a cursor or lovable. They're just making AI being closer to your code base. You don't need to copy paste code in a chat and paste it back. That's fine. But they're not solving you the main problem. You need to spend hours constructing the right context to fit the AI to achieve the right results. You need also to have the correct project setup with the correct fundamentals to build on top of. Now imagine a real senior engineer with 10 years of experience who've done it 1000 times, taking all the best libraries, configurations, coming up with the right project structure, then having him plugged, but not to cursor, no, no, plugged in to a dedicated workflow, which has a predefined set of rules of how to construct the right context. Rules which are very specific to this project, giving results like it was trained to work with. You still have a coding power to the latest Gemini, but the context is dynamically created in the workflow. The workflow loads the context with the code actually needed to run the prompt. The context is constructed to code in this specific project with a strict rule set. It reruns the prompt itself when the result is not matching the code standards or file is broken. Providing the feedback on each specific file and align with the incorrect implementation, it acts like an instant first level of code review on itself, telling AI to fix it before you even see the initial results. You don't believe yet? Let me show this in action. That's my boilerplate starting point. Watch my other videos to find out what's included and how it works. I focus today straight on the building. Let's create a landing page from scratch instead of this view. So I will just describe it. Please create a landing page in some component dot tsx it should have the dark mode with light font visible font specs from top to bottom navbar with a company name and drop down menu hero section with uh, with big title and subtitle email sign up section with a uh, email input testimonials section footer section It should be nicely styled like a professional landing page website. I have a feedback on um, what the workflow is currently executing. Okay, so let's uh, pull the file into the project. This is the result with zero extra work. Definitely everything is addressed. Navigation menu, hero section, email sign up testimonials footer everything is there looks good let's maybe improve a testimonials section let's make this scrollable horizontally i can imagine having a lot of testimonials um, i need them to be scrolled okay so please in some component dot tsx improve the testimonials section to have 10 testimonials and they need to be nicely 
styled and scrolled horizontally. Okay, I have the results. Um, now let's let's check. It's surgeon's precision. It's too easy. Let's uh, freaking challenge it. Please, in some component dot tsx prove the testimonials section. So they are now animated horizontally like autoplay carousel with CSS. I have the results now. Um, let's check. And you cannot tell me this is not impressive. Let's take a look at the implementation. Although this works, this is in proper module. The components um, in here are from the Radix UI, uh, which is a component library in my boilerplate. All the imports are correct. It's all Tailwind styled with a without me underlying that, because the context is right. And this is where real fun begins. This level of precision applies to all API communication, database operations, access control, and basically all what is needed to run your full stack app. I am going to launch it, the boilerplate and this dedicated AI workflow, outperforming every AI tool when it comes to full stack Next.js apps. Just go to my page next boilerplateai.com and just drop me your email. For the first 100 signups, the boilerplate is for free. You will also get the earliest access to the AI workflow. I will bring a lot more content on that. Subscribe my channel to not to miss any and check my other videos to watch this setup in action. See you.